Hey guys and welcome to not another dueling Excel, but a response to one of those videos. This is a video that goes for this question, this question that one, two, three, four, Barchi ask. Uh, for a slowest time that is within two seconds of the fastest, which will be the biggest. Uh, Mr. Excel and Excel is fun. Uh, they provide two solutions, uh, each one. Well, he, uh, Mr. Excel only provided one uh, here using table and the database functions, and you can go you, you can go ahead and see those solutions and the video that I'm responding to. But here in this video, we're going to be using the Power Pivot way. What is the Power Pivot way? It's just a fancy way to say that I'm going to be using Power Pivot to come up with a solution to this case. Uh, first, we need to start by defining a table and then import that table into our data model so we can actually create a power pivot uh, solution. Uh, since we have a data set here of values uh, that Barchi provided, I'm gonna go uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just transform this into a table with hitting control T then hitting enter once I have this table, I'm going to go for the power field ribbon and click here where it says add to data model so you can import this table to my data model. Once it's here, I can just click here where it says pivot table, existing worksheet, insert the pivot table here, and then uh, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna drag the sector field to the rows. Let's go. Sector one, sector two, and sector three. What's missing? The solution, the formula. I need to actually write a formula here. How I'm gonna write the formula? I'm gonna go ahead to this calculated fields uh, icon. Our new calculated field is gonna be a new measure in Excel 2010. I'm going to name this solution and here I'm going to write the formula. The formula is going to be simple. It's going to be calculate and what it's going to calculate is that I want the maximum of the numbers field but I want it to be the maximum of a filter table. I want to filter a table. I want to filter the only table that I have. I want to filter by the column that is called numbers. So it can only show the values that are below or equal to the fastest time plus two seconds. Close parenthesis. I'm going to check the formula. Yeah, they haven't fixed this yet. We're still waiting on this. Uh, I'm going to be clicking here where it says OK. And fair enough, it gave me the solution that I wanted. Let's just take a look here. OK, so this is the solution that Mike had. It is correct. It's actually gave me the solution that I was hoping to get. Now that's pretty much it. That's the power pivot way. If you actually have uh, any questions, uh, if you have any questions that you want it to be featured in a, a, a new video, uh, just let me know in the comment section. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And have a good one. Bye.